calibration of short temperature devices can be problematic. In this short video, we will show you how to use the Aditel Short Probe Kit to improve temperature calibration results when working with shorter style probes and transmitters. The Aditel Short Probe Kit includes everything you will need to install the kit, with the exception of a number one Phillips screwdriver. The inserts shown at the top represent the standard sized inserts included with the kit. A 3mm diameter reference probe is included along with a new top vent panel and custom tool to help complete the drywall transformation. Please remember to power off the ADT875 before installing the Aditel Short Probe Kit. Start by removing any insulators or inserts that might be in the well of the ADT875 from previous calibration work. Remove the four screws holding the top vent panel in place. Be careful not to drop any screws into the drywall. Remove the top insulation ring surrounding the well with the provided tool. Note that the tool is double-sided, so if it doesn't seem to line up, try turning it over. Using the other side of that same tool, remove the second insulating ring surrounding the well. Install the new top vent panel provided, being careful once again not to drop any screws into the drywall. You'll notice that this new top vent panel has a larger opening to help accommodate the larger inserts with the kit. Carefully install the insert of choice that came with your kit. Note the small reference hole in the insert. Carefully install the reference probe at the desired depth. Best results are normally realized when inserting the reference probe to a depth similar of the length of the device under test. Carefully insert the device under test into the well. It's always a good idea to check with the manufacturer of the device under test to understand the internal construction of the apparatus being calibrated. Now you're ready to collect data more accurately from your short probe or transmitter device. If you wish to restore the ADT875 to its original configuration, simply follow these steps in reverse. Remember, for safety, to turn off and unplug the 875 before doing so. We hope that you've found this video to be informative and useful. For more information, please visit us at www.adatel.com.